What is the cosmological model and how does it work? The cosmological model is a scientific theory that explains the origin, evolution, and eventual fate of the universe. The model was initially developed by Albert Einstein with his work in special relativity and general relativity. The cosmological model is made up of three parts. Let's take a closer look at each part to understand how they work together to explain our current understanding of our universe. The first part, the Big Bang Theory. The Big Bang Theory is a theory of how the universe emerged from a singularity. The theory was developed by Georges Lemaitre in 1927. According to this theory, the universe evolved from a single point of infinite density and temperature called the singularity. The Big Bang Theory in psychology is a theory that human consciousness must have emerged from some form of primordial substance. In ancient societies, this primordial substance was thought to be God or the breath of life. The primordial substance hypothesized by scientists is called the Big Bang, referring to the theory that the universe began with a very large explosion. A thought experiment proposed by Bernard Carr in 2012 suggests that if it were possible to create an artificial version of this primordial substance, send the cosmic inflation, the universe is expanding, and it's not just expanding outward. It's also inflating a process that scientists call cosmic inflation. The expansion of the universe is accelerating. This means that the universe will continue to grow in size and age more quickly than we thought. Astronomers have discovered a mysterious void deep within the Milky Way. The region is shaped like a peanut, and it's nearly twice as massive as our galaxy. It's so large that it cannot be seen with telescopes on Earth only from space. The third, the dark energy. Dark energy is a term used in physics to describe the energy that exists in the universe. It is not a matter of what we can see or detect. Dark energy, as defined by scientists, has been present since the beginning of time. However, it was only discovered in 1998 when scientists from Australia and Germany came up with an idea that there might be some extra mass or energy that was not accounted for. This discovery proved to be groundbreaking because it helped physicists understand how mass and energy are related and how they interact with each other in the universe. The discovery of dark energy, as well as its name, helped further what is known as the Big Bang Theory. Dark energy is the name given to a hypothesized form of energy that exists in the universe. How did Einstein discover the secret of the cosmological model? Some people believe that Einstein discovered the secret of the cosmological by himself. The cosmological is a theory that explains how our universe came into existence. It also predicts how it will end up in the future. It is a theory that does not have enough evidence to prove it, but still has some credibility. The cosmological was first developed by Sir Isaac Newton in his Three Laws of Motion and Ernst Mach in his Principle of Inertia. Newton's three laws are as follows. 1. Objects at rest remain at rest unless acted upon by an outside force. 2. Objects in motion continue moving with the same speed and direction unless acted upon by an outside force. 3. For every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. This principle states that the universe has no center, meaning the Earth does not lie at the center of the universe, but rather is just one planet in a solar system or one galaxy within a cluster. These are known as Newtonian principles. Max principle is that inertia is relative to frames of reference. This means that when an object moves, it exists in different frames of reference. For example, let's say you are watching a ball roll down a slope. If you are standing first person and you are watching the ball, then the ball is not rolling down a slope. However, if you are standing third person and you are watching the ball, then the ball is indeed rolling down a slope. Newtonian Principles The universe has no center. Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. The Law of Universal Gravitation Law of Momentum A body must be at rest or moving in a straight line to conserve energy and not change speed. The Role of Quantum Mechanics in a Cosmological Model The quantum mechanics is the branch of physics that deals with the behavior and interactions of subatomic particles. It is impossible to predict what will happen in a quantum system, as it is not possible to know all informations about it. This idea was first proposed by Albert Einstein in 1905. Quantum mechanics is a quasi-classical theory that differs from classical mechanics in that it has rules and laws that govern how particles interact with each other. This led to the development of quantum electrodynamics. 
radioactivity and nuclear fission were discovered by Henri Becquerel in 1896, but it was not until the 20th century that a practical use for nuclear energy was found. The first commercial power plant to use uranium fuel rods was started up in France in 1948. Today, there are over 17,000 operating commercial nuclear reactors producing about 10% of the world's electricity. They are produced when an accelerated electron collides with a molecule of the gas helium, and the collision knocks an X-ray photon out of the electron. Today, X-rays are used for their medical applications, and in industrial radiography. X-rays are able to pass through materials that would normally block gamma rays such as lead and wood. In 1895, Wilhelm Conrad Röntgen discovered X-radiation while investigating radiation from cathode rays in his laboratory. He founded that they could penetrate deep into matter without causing damage. After the discovery, he decided to investigate what created these rays, and found that they had a new type of invisible electromagnetic radiation. Soon after, X-rays were used to create the first medical photographs, and also were used to find flaws in old jewelry. They are still used today for their medical applications and can be useful in detecting metals such as lead or uranium as well as finding flaws in antique jewelry. X-rays are electromagnetic waves with a wavelength from 0.001 to 10 nanometers and the energy of an X-ray photon is typically hundreds or thousands of electron volts. The primary hazard associated with X-rays is their ionizing radiation, which can damage DNA, RNA, and other genetic material when cells are exposed to high doses over time. It is recommended that pregnant women limit the use of X-rays as much as possible since high doses during pregnancy have been linked to miscarriage, stillbirths, and congenital malformations. X-ray detectors are used to measure the intensity of X-rays in order to detect their passage through a medium, such as water or flesh. Stay tuned for part 2 of what is the secret of the cosmological model in physics and don't forget to subscribe to my channel please, thank you.